Hello, people of the internet. Today we're going to be reviewing, or I am going to be reviewing, you guys are just going to be watching me, <clears throat> Trudy Cadavan's um, trilogy of the Black Magicians trilogy called The Guild, The Novice, and The High Lord. And it's actually <clears throat> a trilogy, but in reality it's... Uh, six books because she did a prequel to them because they were so well loved and um, she wanted to extend the the story I suppose. These uh, were published after these after these books um, but the setting is set before these books so you can read them however you like you can read these first and uh, you can read these first. They're a trilogy on a, on a, onto themselves. And after reading these, it will lead you to, or sets it up basically of what happens in, in these books. So, <clears throat> as the, this is a fantasy. Uh, it's uh, by Trudy Canavan. Uh, she's Australian, I believe. Uh, not very popular here in the U.S. I don't know. I've never seen anybody uh, read it here. Great story. Uh, <clears throat> especially the first uh, books that she wrote. Very well written. I like them. Uh, they're about... They're basically Harry Potter-ish, sort of. Uh, it's about this... The, the protagonist, the main character, is a female. So, <clears throat> this is... Perfectly for boys and girls, teens and tweens, and adults alike. Um, the the female main character is poor. Um, she doesn't know her origins, and uh, she's basically homeless. And uh, that's what this book starts. And uh, people are rebelling against uh, the magicians. The magicians basically rule uh, and control everything. And um, anyway, she does something that she, as a person with no magic, is not supposed to be able to do, and yet she does it. <clears throat> and she gets accepted into the, <clears throat> what I would say, the academy, the school of magic. And from there, we follow her of what happens through throughout the three books, the trilogy on these, and uh, basically how she changes everything. <clears throat> great series, great fun. It does have magic. Uh, there is uh, quite a bit of romance. Uh, there is no language. Um, there are some, it's more for teens, I wouldn't uh, give it to the younger ones. It's not, there's no sex scenes, but uh, there's a lot more romance and love and uh, what goes along with being a teenager <clears throat> in terms of uh, hormonal and what have you. Great series, great uh, books to give to um, your teenage uh, or tween daughter, niece, uh, granddaughter, uh, if you're, uh, what do you call that, the um, godmother, you can uh, do that as well <clears throat> for Christmas or, what, or whatever, birthday. These are a great series. Terry Cadavan is actually a good, good writer. Uh, I particularly like the first ones that she wrote better than uh, the prequels, but the prequels are pretty good, and uh, you know they follow up what happened before that time and what has brought their world to the current situation while they're in. <clears throat> Go give it a try. I'm going to have her links below. 
Uh, she also has other series, uh, which I've never read. I've never been able to get into, but um, I will have those on there as, uh, as well. And hope you enjoy. Have a great time.